What's up guys, welcome back. Uh, sorry for not uploading yesterday, I was celebrating my 16th birthday, so yeah. uh, thanks to everyone who said happy birthday. It was awesome. Uh, before we get into the video, join the Discord, uh, leave a like and sub. If we could get like 100 likes or something, that would be awesome. And thanks for the support on my past few videos. We're going to be uploading a lot of uh, tutor tutorials throughout this update, so um, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's get into it. This video is going to cover everything that was very poor about the uh, last video because I felt about about a day after it was uploaded, I was like, you know what? There was so much room for improvement, and after my friend Aaron sent me something in the DMs, I wanted to fully test it out, and it made this crazy good. So shout out to Aaron for telling me about this. I don't know if he was the original person to create it, but I just know he told me about it, and it was really genius. Um, so we're going to do that. We're also going to teach you how to fix falling off the conveyors, um, as well as just really any simple tricks you should probably know, um, as well as my upgrader line. You could finally see the upgrader line. Um, I use a green teleporter with a conveyor ramp going into the caramelizer. A converter ramp with Candy Castle, three Eerie conveyors. Um, I then use the Franken Cupcake, Candy Refiner, uh, Lollipopinator, Pumpkin Spice Refiner, um, the Candy Corn, Portable Flamethrower with a Chocolate Coater and a Gummy Refiner, and then an Orange Teleporter Sender. Um, so it's it's pretty dope. Now, in order to do the faster method, you must get at least twenty five points in the uh, the um. Jeez, I'm trying to think. Uh, the sporus with the zombies. So you've got to go kill zombies. Get, I think it's twenty five for the sword giver. Um, by the looks of it, yeah, is the sword giver. You need to do that. And then you will just be set. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's show you what you need to do here. So you're gonna need these items. You're gonna need it. Goes Deary's Plague, Pumpkinite, one sta uh, hydraulic standard platform, Pumpkin Spice conveyors ultimate conveyor and heavenly conveyor you could also use two ultimates i've known that works there's a few different methods you could use um let me see them really quick give me a second okay so you could use things like two candy conveyors which cost four candy at the the npc dude uh hold on i need that dude watch me right now get a relic right now i'm gonna get a relic i'm calling it i am so calling it please give me my first relic god fucking damn it all right so um yeah that was uh that was pretty good loot there we we got you know we, we got some goodies i guess i i don't think so at all um but either way you could use two candy conveyors with pumpkin spice on the end uh two ultimates with pumpkin spice works but pumpkin spice though is just the best you could use for this um overall so i suggest this though uh this is what i've been using and it works very well uh there might be better especially two heavenlies but this is what i do so yeah now um either way you're gonna take the platform and you're gonna raise it keep it at the bottom like this and then press the number two on your keyboard six times so one, two, three, four, five, six. Put it up there like this. Now then you're gonna put this right here in the corner on the left. Then take a pumpkin spice conveyor, put it right here. Take another and put it right here. They should be facing each other, just like that. With the mouths pointing to the middle. Then this uh, arrow should be pointing to the right and then the red at the top for the ultimate conveyor. So it should look like this. 
Uh, red at the top, blue or purple at the bottom. Arrow on the furnace uh, thingy going to the... Or arrow for going to the furnace, not on a furnace. I, I, I can't talk today, okay? Give me a break. No, but, um... Yeah, so then you're going to take your candy factory. Put it right here. And then you grab this. Put it right here. And then just put this under the mine. Now, that will do everything except fix the issue with people falling off their conveyors because I don't fall off my conveyors as you could tell I, I could hit all the buttons and everything so if you're falling off your conveyors there's way more fixes for that than you'd think you could try a ramp I have known that ramps on the ends work um, I'm pretty sure so that could be an option you could do something like this because it really won't get in your way, um, and I highly doubt that you will fall off over them. Um, use infusers, uh, that makes you move faster, and it probably won't push you as much, I guess. I don't know, it's really confusing. Um, but I use infinite infusers with my champion. I don't use, like, righteous wills or anything, I just use infinites. It's a good option for it, so go for that. Um, what else could you do? Oh, I've seen some really neat tricks, like putting candy bags. Um, that was done by one of my friends uh, in his setup. I'm not going to tell who. Uh, and I'm not going to show the setup, but this is credit to them. Um, I don't use this personally because it did push me off to the edges a lot i don't know why it would push me off to the side and every few minutes i would have to keep fixing that so i don't know why um but he wanted to set a private that's the only reason i'm not going to list it off because i don't want people going and asking him for it um but yeah um i do not take credit for that it was not made by me um then uh the Oh, by the way, um, I forgot to mention this. The first video we did for AFK Farming, uh, Jeff, uh, Mr. Jeff and Iser, was a contributor to that, uh, helped me get started with it, and then we just kind of started taking each other's and, like, optimizing them and stuff, so credit to him, too. I forgot to mention that. I apologize. Uh, but yeah, so you could try a lot of things. You could put conveyor walls... On the sides that works too uh these aren't as efficient as the conveyor ramps because let's let's take a conveyor wall and just put it right here and now let's take a conveyor ramp um you will be put more on an angle with this for some reason but it's also going to push you back unlike this where you could just get stuck on the side but it's very unlikely to get stuck on conveyor ramps. I've seen conveyor walls work efficiently too. Um, to some degree, I really don't know which is better or more efficient. I don't really try because I don't need them. Um, but yeah, I know the 2020 conveyors work really good too for this, by the way. Apparently someone said, I think those be good at Edward. Um, but you could just keep trying combinations. Discord conveyors are used pretty often. Um, there's a lot of different things you could try, for sure. Like 100%, there's so many things you could try for this. Um, but yeah, uh, I guess you just have to do some exper uh, experimenting with all that stuff, but yeah. Now on to how to get, you know, the actual really good candy. Um, you want to grab it the Ghost Deary's Plague. Yeah, it's good, good sword. Now this is the Illumina. So, so let's see how long it takes me to get from one end of the base to the other. One, two, three. Okay, so about three seconds. One, two, three. So it's about the same. 
Um, but I do notice a huge difference when you're on the conveyors. Watch. So this is it with uh, Ghost Eerie. I know this is it without anything. So you can see the speed I'm moving at. This is it with uh, Illumina. And this is it with Ghost Eerie. So there's, there's a pretty significant difference there. Um, so you want to hold this sword and just start auto-clicking. And then just watch it start racking in. It's insane with what you could get. You could get anywhere from like 120 all the way to like 240. Um, you just have to align your thing right, and then you can get it. Otherwise, it's really easy. Um, yep, that should be good. There we go. So, once you get your mouse aligned, you're pretty much set. Uh, it will never screw up from here, but if you guys find uh, any issues with this, please DM me. I will fix it up for you. I'm sorry for the huge lag on this right now. I know there's a lot of lag on the video recorder. I don't know what just happened for a second there, but um, Jesus, that was horrible. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Join the Discord, and have a good one. Peace out.